Polish World War II cinema tells the story of one of the greatest underdog nations at the center of both Soviet and German aggression. Even after being overwhelmed, the Polish fought for the Allies in France and then the UK. Polish resistance fighters in Warsaw also put up the largest single resistance movement in European history. Here are three modern World War II movie recommendations that help highlight Poland's paramount place in World War II history. Well, the one thing we all already know how to do is fly. Number three, Mission of Honor, aka Hurricane 303 Squadron, a co-British-Polish production telling the story of the critical role Polish pilots played during the Battle of Britain, focusing on 303 Squadron RAF flying Hawker Hurricanes. 303 Squadron claimed the largest number of aircraft shot down during the Battle of Britain. The Battle of Britain, the fight for the control of British airspace and ability to remain in the war, it was one on such a narrow margin that every pilot in this movie deserves recognition. Hey, what are those? Bend the drink. You should try it. They give it to us instead of sleep now. Mission of Honor not only pays tribute to Polish aces, and there were many, the movie also features aces from Canada and Czechoslovakia. Temper your expectations for the flight sequences in this movie. The budget was only $10 million. What's most important is the compelling real story of the Polish pilots. Notably, the movie also highlights how the Polish were ostracized by post-war British-Soviet politics on Poland's place within the Soviet-dominated East. The 303 Squadron were outspoken against Soviet and Nazi fascism throughout the war, and many were not welcome back in Soviet Poland. Number 2. The Pianist Based on Holocaust survivor and pianist Wadislaw Spielmann's autobiography, this will be the most internationally well-known movie on the list, and highly acclaimed. The film was a co-production of France, the United Kingdom, Germany, and Poland. The movie is an excellent portrayal of the Nazi brutalization of Jews in Poland, particularly when highlighting the suffering from within the infamous Warsaw Ghetto. The pianist uses numerous brutal real-life accounts of violence everyday Jews and Poles suffer through at the hands of their German occupiers. The movie underscores the extremes of good and evil, including not only the ability to kill, but to survive and save others. The pianist covers interesting subjects, such as the imposed Jewish councils who manage the ghettos, and the murky role Jewish ghetto police played in its organization. The movie also focuses on the Polish resistance and Warsaw Uprising, with shocking and accurate depictions of the raising of Warsaw. Spielmann died in Warsaw, July 6, 2000, at the old age of 88. Number 1, Warsaw 44, a movie focusing on one of the most horrific struggles and city battles in all of World War II which is of course the Warsaw Uprising of 1944 that saw the systemic raising of the city block by block. By January of 1945, 85% of Warsaw was destroyed. Warsaw 44 does justice to the tens of thousands of resistance and home army fighters in the largest European resistance movement during the entire war. During the 63 days of fighting, 16,000 Polish resistance fighters and 200,000 civilians would perish. Na przedporach stolicy stoją już dywizje sowieckie. Liczymy, że Sowieci wykorzystują nasz zryw. Further adding to the tragedy, the resistance fighters fought with the understanding they were to be reinforced by a Soviet advance that did not come. The Warsaw Uprising is best described as devastating, which is the movie's main theme, drawing you into constant personal and civil destruction. The director actually used 500,000 tons of debris during the filming of the movie to show the carnage. The directing for Warsaw 44 is atypical at times using slow motion or first-person views. The character development is balanced perfectly, with the majority of the plot surrounding the historic event rather than unrelated drama. Alright, I'm Johnny, your narrator. I want to thank you for watching this video. This list is not comprehensive, so please feel free to add any recommended Polish or other war movies in the comment section below. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.